guys and welcome back to my channel in today's video i'm in kasupe uh, a place known as kawaya so kasupe kawaya which is the last station on kasupe road that's the video for today if you are new on my channel subscribe turn on bell notification give this video a thumbs up yes so I'll be moving from Lumumba station showing you how much it costs, how people live in Kasupe, what kind of plots are here. King David, we are together with King David in Kasupe, and that's the video. So it's showing me a bit of Kasupe, which is characterized by very big plots. These are actually farmlands. For your information, this is the place where. Speaker of the National Assembly, Mary Muti. This bus you are seeing here, yes, it is known as TC Transport. Yes, this bus in front of me. It loads in the same Lumumba station. It goes to Luangwa Feira. So Feira is the border town between Zambia and Mozambique. Balo World, or uh, car, where they say oh, the machinery called the CAT, C A T. On Lumumba Road, this is where we enter a road known as Mungui Road. So on our left is the Balo World, and so we are officially on Mungui Road on our way to Kasupe. So this is the place where we are going to check the kind of housing or the residential area for the particular people who lives in this particular area. So can you get uh, a piece of property? That's what this video is all about. Can you find a house for rent or can you get a plot to buy? That's what this video is all about. Please don't forget if you are new on my channel, subscribe, turn on bell notification, give this video a thumbs up. Let's go.
oh, these big fences, this is where trucking company, I saw more than four trucking companies who have bought land here, that's where they like park their trucks or they park uh, or they service them from, or oh, that's where they have established their offices. So this place is character. So you can see this one is known as Billy Bus. They have both these coaches. Uh, they also have smaller buses like the one I was on. Uh, this particular bus where I was. You can see this one is fenced. Uh, because it is their office. They also have a lot of trucks inside this, uh, this premise. So farms typically start. Listen to me about 10 kilometers or less slightly less than 10 kilometers you find that um, you start finding houses in the kasupe area these big big plots of land i call them farmlands yet this place it goes on beyond up to another place known as kawaya or kawaya very far big plots of land others have made orchards others have made you know perennial fields where they own a farm during the rainy season if you observe if you observe on the right yes here on the right yes here some people have like built houses part of their land built a number of houses and have put them on rent so rent here is really super cheap than other parts of lusaka why i don't know why this place is so much neglected and the, to many people it feels like it's too far most of the passengers who are on this bus I was so shocked to interact with them, most of them, they are actually landowners. These are actually, they are not tenants, they don't rent, it is their own property. Yet the distance is very, very near. Transportation, you pay less than one dollar, yes, it is 14 kwacha. In fact, when going to town, you can pay like half a dollar, eight kwacha or ten kwacha going back when you are going back into the central business district. Some of this land is so virgin such that uh, it has never seen, like where I was pointing here, trees which have been there maybe more than 50 years nothing no agricultural activity but the owners have just chosen to keep it there is even a hammer mill like this one which we call a chigayo farmers here bring their maize because there are farmers here this is a distance just above 10 kilometers an executive barber shop as well very shortly i'll be showing you a ranch where i saw quite a lot of animals for speaker of the national assembly our first speaker of the first nation uh, of national assembly in zambia mrs nelly muti <laughs> gentlemen behold this is the farm for speaker of the national assembly of zambia mrs nelly muti take a look all this vast land this place should be around slightly under 15 kilometers from the lusaka business district yes so she's got all this land here but on the left this one is a there is a private 
or a community school. So how did it but it pass through the farm? I'm going to turn back because so that you can see the place really, really well. So this is the furthest place where we have dropped people who came to Lusaka West Kasupe. And now, ladies and gentlemen, once more, I want you to see it clearly from this angle. This is the ranch for Speaker of the National Assembly, Mrs. Nelly Muti. Yes, she is the first. Zambia has never had a female speaker of the National Assembly. This is her ranch. Take a look at how big the place is so vast. So vast. These are some of the houses for the workers who work at this particular uh, ranch. So this is uh, what made me so interested. This track is going to Zesco where we just saw these posts they are posters about land so this place yes you can get land from uh, what shocked me is that land here differs from place to place but at least do you know that you can get a plot of land the owners of the land can give you a cut uh say between one thousand dollars to about two thousand five hundred dollars yes maybe 30 by 30 land or 50 by 50 they can give you that sort of land for you to have so guys i appreciate you so much for always coming back to watch my videos please do me a favor i i am trying to hit a hundred thousand subscribers by december thank you so much for your support i'll see you in my next video